A lot of people assume I'm the younger sister, and I am. It's pretty obvious. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. Remember to moisturize, okay? And now I'm gonna pass it on to the best man, Jerry's best friend, Garrett. Here we go. So, uh, one story that comes to mind when I think of Jerry is Jerry and I went to a rodeo. Yeah, yeah it's funny, because we're in a, a cowboy restaurant, but I would have told this story either way. Um, so we're at the rodeo, right? And we're watching these guys ride the bucking Broncos. And Jerry leans over to me and says, I can do that. <laughs> So sad. So sad. You sure I can't get you a drink? No. Cranberry juice? What do I have, a UTI? I, sorry. Just go enjoy the wedding. That sounds like something someone says, but they don't actually want you to do it. It's not like that. Okay, there's no reason for both of us to be stuck back here. You sure? Please, just go have fun. Be back in a few. Rude. So we're flying, okay? We're doing 80 down the freeway, and the mob guys are chasing us because they had money on the rodeo, all right? And I lean over to Jerry. I go, Jerry, what are you getting me into here? And Jerry, <laughs> calm as a cucumber, looks at me, tips down his sunglasses, and goes, Welcome to my life. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sandra, welcome to Jerry's life. Let's all raise a glass to many more adventures. Congratulations. Cheers. <laughs> Where did you get sunglasses? I guess at a rodeo. All right, so next up, we have the maid of honor. Um, Dina? Anyone? Five nine, brown hair, shouted bomb during the ceremony. Damn it, Dina, you had one job. Dina's stretch. Uh, okay, uh, so what else can I tell you guys about Jerry? Um, apparently anything I want. Okay. Dina, come on, you... What the hell? 